Okay, so hey, hopefully you can see me. I apologize if it's a little dark. My um, I'm doing this off of my phone. So pretty much, um, somebody asked me how do I detangle my hair. I just got out of the shower, and I find that the shower is the easiest way for you to shampoo your hair and not have it so tangly. For the simple fact that you're actually holding your head back. And this is the direction that you comb your hair when you detangle it. So when you start getting into detangling your hair at a sink and it's going down like this, all of your hair is getting more tangled this way. And then you sit up and you want to comb your hair when it's been shampooed and vigorously shooken and everything like that in that direction. That makes it so much more harder. So um, the stuff that I did, I got in the shower. I used the Patrick Bradley Psychedelic Cleansing Shampoo as my um, pre-shampoo. And I did that twice because I just took a sew-in out. So I wanted to make sure my hair was really clean. Then I did the Moroccan Oil uh, Moisturizing Repair Shampoo. And this is a 8.5 ounce. Um, this runs about $22. And I've had this maybe four or five months. So invest in good products. Um... And lastly, I use the conditioner, the hydrating mask by one mask by one and only. This is really good stuff. I love that. I don't use the conditioner for Moroccan oil because personally, I feel like the hydrating mask does better for me on my hair type. Of course, everyone's hair is different. After I put my hydrating mask on, I did leave it on while I was in the shower. And I used a wide comb. I combed through my hair from the bottom up with the conditioner still on my hair. That helps as a... A tool to help detangle better as far as when you have nothing in your hair and you've rinsed everything out and whatnot so that's what you mainly need to do to have an easily detangle process and um, after I got done shampooing my hair I took a shower of course while I was in there don't put your hair in the towel that's the worst thing you can do because it dries all of the moisture out of your hair and the water so that's why a lot of people can't comb through their hair when they get done shampooing their hair because they walk around the house with a towel on and it just dries it up. So then it's kind of like when you get your hair air dried and you haven't combed it, it's a little bit more knotty, right? Right. So you can either, what I did was I didn't have a um, processing cap slash shower cap because I don't use them. I actually just braided my hair back while I was in the shower and just let it stay damp while I was in there. Um, of course, the water ran down from the braid, and then I got out, and then I just damped it a little bit. You don't want to leave it on the, like I said, that's not good for you. Um, what I use afterwards, I usually use something called Bio Silk, and it's a leave-in conditioner. It's perfect. It smells great, and it feels great. Makes your hair feel so soft. I don't have any more right now, and I barely have any Design Essentials HCO, but this is also a leave-in conditioner that also helps protect once you blow dry or flat on your hair. So I just spray that on. And at this point, after you already detangled your hair with your hydrated mask on or your conditioner, it should kind of be detangled already. So you shouldn't have much work to do. Once again, comb from the bottom and work your way up. And if you need to do sections, I know if your hair is tangled at the roots, you won't be able to part sections. But kind of just pull it apart, you know? And that'll help as well. So then, um, there you have it. You're pretty much done. More to talk about products really quickly. Um, the better your products, the better your hair is easier to detangle, the better the results. So, buying products, Tresemme and stuff from Walmart, CVS, Walgreens, and stuff like that, that is really, really cheap, that's not good stuff for you. You don't want to do that. Those things contain alcohol. And alcohol dries your hair out just like it dries your skin out. So invest in the um, good products. All of these products, except for Patrick Bradley, can be found on my website. If you have any professional products that you want to purchase through me, please email me at info at hinjadesigns.com. I'll have it at the bottom. And I'll order it for you because I'm a licensed cosmetologist. So if you have any more questions, let me know, and I'll be glad to, have, to help you and answer them. Bye-bye.